Hello there, my name is Spooky and Aaron. Welcome back for another round of Getting Over It with Bennett Foddy. Okay. So, um, I know that I'm still working on it. It's going to take me forever. Um, but I am still working on the 200 video special. Um, it's no longer the 200th video special. Whatever. Um, but hey, uh, achievement. I got myself back to where I was in this dreaded oh. game. Um, after a lot of toil and suffering on my end, so, that's good, um, I know the last, I, the, <laughs> the last few ones, the last few videos, I have gotten real close to raging, I have gotten real close, but, I would not say that I have raged yet. I will fully admit to being slightly aggravated. But will not admit to raging. Okay. I gotta keep calm. My hands are already sweating. So that's a good sign. Well, that worked. Okay. Come on. There we go. Sit down on the toilet. Whoa. Okay. Don't do that. Don't do that. This. That is a thing that screws me up all the time. As we've but on the off chance that you're playing this, what I'm saying is, Bennett! trash is disposable, Bennett, but maybe it doesn't back. have to be approachable. I've missed What's the you, feeling like? Are you stressed? I guess you don't hate it if you got this far. Feeling frustrated? It's underrated. I've missed you, Bennett. I missed you so much. I'm not going to celebrate at this point because I know that this game still has the entire possibility of taking it all away from me. Like that? This is an interesting area. Okay, I've never been here before. I'm not, I'm on the other side now. But I don't know if I can, <clears throat> if I can get to where I want to be from where I currently am. Because this stuff is blocking. I'm, I'm on top of where the boxes are, so, okay. Okay, I was about to say, if I just keep sliding down, I should be able to catch myself. Hopefully. I'm by the boxes. So, hey, it took some progress from me, but not much. Uh. Ooh, okay. That was risking a lot. There's so many buttons on my, com my on my on my mouse. Like I'm normally only ever used to like three button mice, which is like left and right click and then the middle mouse button, the the scroll wheel. But this one has so many on it. It has one, 
and two more and <laughs> I click randomly at random times and I don't know why. What I gotta do. There we go. Another good question for this game is like, is this like supposed to oh, make some sort of representation of life? Like, is this like an actual world? Because I mean, we do know of at least one other inhabitant of this world other than my cauldron man. I know of one. Possibly two, I can't remember. I think just one. Like, is, th is this an actual world? Is this a place that multiple people live in? We know of, of two inhabitants, and that is cauldron man and the kid on the slide. And that's the only occupants of this world that we know of. But, like, is there a bigger picture to this? Are there more people? I will never know, I guess. And I suppose... I, I, maybe... Because we have Bennett himself, but he's not really, he doesn't seem to really live in this world. He just kind of is the voice in the sky, god narrator type character. And he quotes people. He quotes people from this world. From our world so does that also raise the question that this is actually just some location in our world that this man is climbing a mountain made of stuff but then again there are things in this world that don't make sense that don't obey the laws of physics. No. Like that. Like wait like this. This this ladder is being held on. I suppose that could possibly make sense, but there's not much we don't see past this building. This little like back porch type area. So we don't know what all is holding this this house up in this in the sky like it is. So I don't know. See? We've got that one other occupant over there. That's the kid on the slide. And I do hear what sounds like in the background. Like I occasionally hear what sounds like cars. Like the possibility of screeching cars, but then also like possible no. almost like foot traffic like people talking and stuff like that <laughs> the real question is why did this man just decide one day I'm gonna climb this mountain but I'm not going to do it like a normal mountain climber would do. I am going to risk literally everything and be completely death defying. And if I were to like, honestly, some of the falls that I have taken in this game, I should be dead. My guy should be dead. But you know, 
this cauldron of gravity buffering takes away any fall damage. Okay. <laughs> I look at the time, and it's 4.48 for me here. Um, I have to be at work in an hour, and that also requires me getting ready for work and then walking to work. I mean, get walking to work is about 15 minutes. Maybe a little more. There we go. Okay. Oopsie want to set myself back down on the camera. Also, I salute that camera because it can hold a lot of weight and not break it off. I'm like, whatever screws are holding that into the wall are really strong. <laughs> like, it makes me wonder. It's like, what length screws... <gasps> Okay. I honestly feel like I have been stuck in the same area for years. Like, I have not gotten past this. The. You have now seen the furthest that I have ever gotten in this game. And that was. To that one area. Around that bend. See, that right there messes me up. But yeah. Okay. I want to try because I have the ability to um, when I go when I I don't know if I'll be able to do it. We can try. We can try. But that's not the way I normally get up there. Why did I just do that? Um, but I want to try and make it so that I can upload this one tonight. I can upload this video tonight. And... Ooh. I'd love to be able to do that. But, I don't know. I'll try. I'll try and upload this tonight. I'm making plans that you guys honestly don't care about. <laughs> You're like, just play the game! We don't care about your other life. And I fully understand that. I don't know why I tried that last time. Why I tried to launch myself over here. I'm like, I have never done that once before. Why did I just try it now? Okay. Okay. That did not work. At all. I, I wish I could... Like, I had enough force to... 
Yeah, I'm not near enough force to launch myself up that high. <laughs> Guys, we're gonna reach like 2030, and I'm still gonna be playing this. Everyone's already gonna be like completing, getting over it like five, and I will still be here in this area. Okay. I didn't need that anyways. Well, hey. All that matters is that I made a little bit of progress in this video. <laughs> now what I really need to make progress in is a bunch of other things. Hey, if I even just get back to where I was before I have to end the video, that would be nice. <clears throat> or not. You know, that works too. <clears throat> There has literally never been a game that has made my hands sweat as much as this uh. game does. I know. This is something I'm having to keep my eye out on. Because for some reason, I changed the way I'm recording things a little bit. Just a, not too much. Just a bit so it should make it... Oh. A little bit easier for me to makes it a little a little bit easier for me to do some things but not too much it saves me a little bit of storage space but for some reason my recording software decided hey I know you had it set your like computer set up to record audio and stuff like that but for some reason, I was up the other night. I don't know how long, how late I was up. Just because I noticed this after recording something. That the game audio didn't record. Uh. I don't know why it keeps getting stuck there. Is it because I'm not, like, flinging myself as fast as I can up this mountain? I... <laughs> I am in no way a speedrunner at any game. And I will say I'm not a professional at literally any game. Because I know you have like professional like Minecraft players, professional League of Legends players, people like that. Not me. That's certainly not me. <sighs> Go. Hey, I didn't say to do that, buddy. Buddy. Honestly, if I could figure it out, I definitely would 
already <laughs> have like a way to record not only my face in the game but also my mouse because this game doesn't use any other controls it's just the mouse which i mean games like that i salute them partially for like being able to like basically make the controls simple enough that hey You there, the idiot who can't get up the mountain. I got myself stuck. I'm gonna fall. But yeah, the like being able to go to the fact that like I'm normally, of course, I'm used to a lot of games that are like mouse and keyboard. That's like WASD controls, WASD those of you who don't know what that is um if you don't know what that is i'm surprised you don't know what that is but whatever <coughs> most of the games uh -huh. i play you know, <clears throat> i don't know why all of a sudden i can't do that anymore I'm going to have freaking nightmares about this game. And just the amount that I cannot complete. Come on. I think I'd be an old pro at this section by now. But nope. Why? Just why? Okay. Well. At least I made some progress. I made like a hundred feet worth of progress <laughs> out of 70 miles. <laughs> but that's still progress. I might just have to stream this someday. Just so that... <laughs> I'm gonna get to... Like I said, I, I'm pretty sure I asked you guys how many... How many Let's Plays do you guys think this is gonna take me? Because I've seen other people, they've got like like five part let's plays of this game and they get to the top of the mountain and i'm on part like eight <laughs> and i still haven't gotten past this one part. <sighs> but i'm all oh, no. i'm all out of time for this one um i'm gonna try and see if i can get this one out tonight because I don't have, I don't, I'm actually, st I'm starting to run out of videos that I have banked up, but, all the time. If you like this video, please like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.